so scared. I ship it. <laughs> no. I, I was so scared. No more. I, I don't like the dark. Wh why do I? I. It's okay, CC. I'm sorry. I knew you were scared, but it's fine now. Don't cry. Ah. I'm sorry. I was I was scared and confused. It's all right. I'm glad you're not hurt. Did you find what you were looking for? N no, not yet. It wasn't in the room we stayed in. I wonder where it could be. Oh, is she the girlfriend? The previous tenant's girl thing. It must be important if you're looking all along. You can always just give up on it. It's not entirely safe here. I can't give up on it. I have to find it. What exactly is it? Sorry to ask, but I've been I've just been wondering. Was it a present? Or It's a present from my boyfriend. It's the most important thing to me. After my own life. Ah, I see. Sorry if I was rude. I'll keep looking for it too. You're looking for someone, right? I haven't met anyone yet, but can you tell me more about them? Uh well I don't know that much either. Just that he's a man about my age. Huh? You know that little about the person you're looking for? <laughs> yeah, you're a strange guy, David. I'm not. There's just some things I want to ask. And I don't know how he looks because um strange, but very kind. Hey. I wouldn't be hurt badly if you weren't here. I'm really grateful to you for saving me. I should get going. Take care, David. David, sorry. I'll see you. Oh, she's leaving now, finally. And I'm all alone now. God damn it. God damn it. Let's drop. I can't. Okay, never mind. Why you not jump? Leap of faith. I have faith in you to jump. But you know jump. Library. Nothing? Maybe not. Let's go out. For all you know. Why you still want to look around? My god! Let's go back and see the crooked man. Hello! Oh, it's open! <laughs> shit! Th the basement door is open! Oh shit! Close it! My god! Why you still go down? Why you go down? You smart ass! Uh, is she still... Oh, fuck my life, fuck my life, fuck my life. She... Oh, there's an item! There's something here. Got the bronze key, why not? Let's check items, what is this? Yeah, that's all they tell you, a bronze key. Okay... Nothing... Bronze key, I bet it's this, but... Yeah! Get in! Barrels! Look! Wine castles, they seem almost empty, not surprised. Give me wine! Beer, anything! They seem to be full. Use it! Ready, it's got tons of alcohol in it. I may just catch fire if I drank this. Seriously? Uh, wine glass. A glass. Yeah! Okay, book. A journal seemingly written by a staff member. The last page is rambling and sloppily written. A toast store owner who left his employees and fled into the night. We'll drink all the beer we got. Hell, it's the only good thing here. Being our job's no good, but at least we don't have to see his mark no more. We were so sick of that egghead, always trying to flaunt his intelligence. Installing weird stuff on the basement door, having a number lock on the food storage. Oh, it's silly crap made the place impossible to run. Paranoia much? Plus the passport was this thing with a book, which she changed out every month. What the hell do you do if you forget? Maybe it's good for him, but sure as hell not us. Ah, whatever. Once we're done in the booth, we're out of here. Toast to our bright futures. Sounds really bad, the hotel. Uh, I'm surprised. It's in the mountain. The door to the food storage is at the far end of the first floor, right? A passcode on food is pretty crazy. But oh, you know, there are human meat in there? A journal, see me. Oh, okay, shit, I, re I reread. 
Pass up! You stop with the. Ninja! Ah, oh, damn it! I have to fight for passcode now, don't I? God damn it! Damn it! Nothing! Really? Okay, for all you know, I, I might not have read properly, so I'll just go and check again. Oh, but it's the owner's password, right? So I should just go and check over here. There should be some clues or something. Okay. The black boy in the owner's room said, The strange case of Dr. Jack and Mr. Hyde. It'll be on the shelf, right? Ah, here you go. Story of the door. Mr. Orkerson was the lawyer, was a man of rugged countenance that would like but she calls him the back of the air better. I be a baby, Bobby, 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 Bobby,
Uh, what? Oh, okay. Smells rotten. Oh, young. Uh, for all you know, eh? You see something shining, but it's our reach. Damn it! Use a ladder then! Take it! I could use this to get out to that thing. Yeah! Okay. Got the key to 210. 210. Anyway. But anything else? No knife? Why you not take knife? You need to def. Oh, oh, you know, oh, I'm expecting the rotter crooked man right now. Okay, 210. What is 210? Okay, it's over there, it's at the top. Okay, good, 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 good. 210. No, 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 it's over there. 210. Okay, here's the last one. Okay. 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 Unlock the door. And there's a broken shard of thing. What is that broken shard of thing? Looks like something that was badly burned. Huh? Okay. Was this a photo? Looks like it was a woman. Hmm, there's something under the pieces. Got a scrap again from the notebook. Wait, I don't need her memory anymore. I know she won't come back. So I have to forget everything, good and bad. Uh, my my head hurts. Uh, da, da, da. Suddenly, cook up man. Sit yeah. down. Sheesh, I'm exhausted. I guess I haven't slept much. What with your room and all, of course. So he burned his photo to clear his broken heart, huh? I I know I couldn't do that. I'll never forget. Not ever. According to Paul. That makes me a pansy. It's okay, I won't judge you! Sissy! <laughs> oh, there you are, David. Did you find the box? No, I can't find it. There are lots of rooms I can't go in, so it might be one of those. What's wrong, David? You look kind of pale. Oh, it's nothing. But Sissy, you should really leave soon. Why? You may not believe me, but there's some kind of bizarre monster around. I found it in the basement. I was attacked by it earlier. Earlier, you definitely be in danger too. So I think you should go. Look, I don't like dark, scary places either. But there's no need to tease me like that. I'm not a kid afraid of the boogeyman. Okay? No, he's speaking the truth. Uh, sorry, but I'm not trying to tease you. I'm telling the truth. <laughs> don't, don't worry, I'm not mad. You don't seem like a dishonest guy. So I like to believe you, but... The monster? Maybe you mixed up something in the dark. You could be sus sus susceptible. susceptible to seeing things when you wander around in the dark like this. 